You should talk to your landlord about fixing the elevator. You okay? I'm getting used to it. So, who are you, oh cute and adorable stranger? I am the prince of the land. I saw you on TV and vowed to save you. Good vow, good vow. Where'd you learn to rap? We poor kids couldn't afford instruments, so we learned how to rap. How about you? We rich kids always thought you poor kids were so cool. So we started rapping in between piano lessons. Well, you rap deaf and cool. <laughs> oh, no. You. You're the rap master. <laughs> I'd like to hear you rap all day long. All lifelong. In fact, will you marry me? Well, uh, seeing as how my prospects are slim, and you are the most eligible bachelor in the kingdom, not to mention a hunk and a half. Sure. What the heck? Okay. Great. Just stay put. I'll be back real soon with a ladder. So, uh, could you, uh... You know, Rapunzel. Oh, Rapunzel. Right, of course. Give me a dramatic close-up. The prince and Rapunzel can't get away with this. I'll get the prince for myself, I will, and then his kingdom will be mine. All that's standing in my way is that brat Rapunzel. But I don't see a problem there. <laughs> This will jog your memory. Uh, isn't that another exciting episode of Knots in My Hair Landing? You should never have dropped your hair for anyone but me. Uh, uh, please forgive me, witch. I'll never do it again. Actually, you did me a big favor. Without your help, I never would have figured out a way to make the prince mine. Get rid of the king and take over the entire kingdom! <laughs> what are you gonna do with me? Let's just consider this a close shave. Oh, good. A very close shave. <laughs> Rapunzel, Rapunzel, put down your hair, that I may climb, etc. Hi there, dream thing. Where's Rapunzel? I sent her on a nice nature stroll through Devil's Forest. She'll be lost forever. Do you think I'm heartless? There's an excellent chance she'll be eaten by wild animals. Rapunzel. Oh, forget about her. What has she got that I haven't got? Certainly not hair. <laughs> Marry me, Snookums. With my property, your royalty will rule the kingdom. Marry you? You're putrid, slimy, and evil. I'll grow on you. Like ringworm. I'm off to find my true love. Wait! No man dumps me. Actually, every man dumps me, but I always get back at him. That will teach you! <laughs> oh, I've got to get a life.
Oh, my glasses. I'm blind without them. Help me, somebody. I've got to find Rapunzel. Rapunzel! 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 Rapunzel? Not Rapunzel. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, you need a map. The witch sent you up on a bum rap. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, you're in despair. You're out of luck and you're out of hair. <laughs> Rapunzel! Prince, Prince. Here, Prince, here, Prince. <gasps> My hair. I can't let him see me like this. I'm coming! Is that you, Rapunzel? Uh, no, it's me, Irma, the talking tree. You sound just like my beloved and bad rapper sweetheart, Rapunzel. What's wrong? You act like you can't see a thing, not even a terrible haircut. The witch dropped me from her tower and broke my glasses. Oh, my poor darling. Irma, I hardly know you. It's me, Rapunzel. Rapunzel, thank goodness I've found you. Let's get out of here. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry, Irma. This is terrible. You can't see, and I don't know where we are. And we're doomed. Don't cry, my sweet. Cry, woman! Cry your little heart out! I could see! Your tears have given me perfect vision! Oh, that. It runs in the family. Our tears have corrected vision for generations. My doctors hate us. Oh, my hair! No, it's all right. Look. <laughs> <laughs> We've got to stop the witch before she takes over everything. I've been thinking, couldn't you create some sort of federal, federal communications, communications commission. commission? I know, but my dad won't do it. We'll have to go right to the people. <laughs> right on. Power to the people. <laughs> Power to the people. <laughs> The people have the power to stop the witch's tower from growing by the hour, and we won't lose. To get the king's permission to make a new commission and start a new tradition, the right to choose. Well, there they go again. Well, you fought long and hard, and your king has heard you. I hereby decree that the witch may own just one local TV station. I also proclaim the formation of three TV networks. Please meet the heads of these networks. Brandon Tartar Black, Brandon Stubborn, and just plain Brandon. And finally, well, I announce the formation of the Federal Communications Commission to make sure that nobody ever tries to take control of TV or radio again. I'm ruined! Max, I'm ready for my close-up now. Yes, madam.
The new commission has come up with a few rules and regulations. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down the rules so those in charge won't look like fools. TV will be entertaining, educational, and high quality forever. Yeah. Hey, Postal Geists, it's time for another letter from the mailbag. Dear Ralph, I'm six months old and filled with despair. When I try to make conversation with my peers, they spit up and they certainly don't share my enthusiasm for Barishnikov. My parents are no better. Last week I greeted them in Latin, they ran in horror and called in an exorcist. Here's my question. I've discovered a theoretical way to bridge time and space. Should I tell the world or am I just asking for trouble? Signed, Witty Bitty Baby. Dear Witty, nobody likes a smart mouth kid. I've got lots to offer too like how to suck the cream out of a Twinkie without opening the package. But the world just isn't ready for certain concepts. Before you discovered the fourth dimension, discover the potty. Well, that's all we have time and space for. See you next week. Witty, baby, baby.